All right, everybody, welcome back to the channel. We are here with another part of this Black Myth Wukong walkthrough. So I was doing a little research in, in between this part and the last one. I believe that is the final boss. I believe that's what that is. Everything I've shown, it seems to be the actual final boss of this uh, of chapter two, the actual boss. But we're not going to do that in this part. We're going to go back. Actually, first off, I'm going to take a quick detour back over to... Blackwind Mountain, so I can upgrade my... Gotta find the right one. I think it's Cave Interior. I want to upgrade my Gourd. I think I have the Luja Fragrant Vine that's needed to upgrade the Gourd. I just have to find the right one real quick. Get that upgraded. Help a little bit. And then we're going to actually go back. Uh, I was doing a little research on some of the secret bosses. I just looked up all the bosses in Chapter 2 just to figure out what their names are and where they're at. And the mission we finished off on last part with the um, the boar, the drunken boar. This is the correct... I don't think this is the correct area as, as what I wanted. No, I think this is the wrong one. I think one more after. I think this might be it. No, it was before White Lack White Clad Noble. It can't be this one. I think this is wrong as well. Dang it. I'm trying to I'm get so lost in these maps. Yeah, it's definitely not it. Okay. So it has to be back here then. Yep, Marsh of White Mist. That's where it is. It even has the logo of the monkey. Okay. So this should be able to upgrade my gourd. And we'll go back to the boar, drunken boar mission. Because actually, finishing his quest line is its own boss fight. And you can unlock a secret area with two more boss fights. So we're going to go ahead and do that in this part. I don't want to say I'm going to fight every boss. Because there's another one in this uh, chapter that I probably won't be able to get to. Uh, that involves all of the Buddha eyes that you can find around the cliffs, I believe. There, oh, I have two of them. This is great. Ah, oh, you need two for the second one. I have six uses at least. And we have the worm. Nice. I revel in drunken. Forty percent, and I have six uses. But keep it from the sober's face. Oh, it increases. Uh, Oh, wait, the next upgrade increases spots for soaks. So I could probably have two. Is that correct? Yeah, I think that next one. Next upgrade. I need Remember, one more. Young friend, a sip Fragrant vine. No, awaken wine warm. Sorry. Okay, let's head back to Yellow Wind Ridge. And we actually have to head to Crouching Tiger Temple. There we go. So, uh, the boar, like, he, he talked to us in the last part to meet us here for some meat. We actually have to go here. I was getting confused, like, was this a new location? But no, it's literally just the same place we beat the Tiger Vanguard. I kind of figured, but I, for some reason I doubted we go backwards in progression. So let's see here. Also, I can unlock the cellar. Since I beat the stone vanguard, I can go back here and... Yeah, he is here. I can unlock the cellar. Oh, this putrid rat. Help me score a tasty treat, will you? I uh, drive me mad. I've been craving a taste of that juicy jade lotus. Can you find me some in this barren land? I just picked some up too, nice. Oh, I wouldn't mind some meatless meals from time to time. Hmm, I have stumbled upon some interesting leads. The realm of gold does hold a connection to this desolate land. I hear the realm of gold is where the sun sets. 
There, they held rats above all others. Mm. And somehow, before we knew it, the realm was gone. Quite odd, that is. Hmm. I just tried those rat guys. They taste like men flesh. Hmm. Its people are not yet extinct. I suspect the Yellow Wind Guai had a role in their downfall. Our senior brother gave me a piece of gold. I'll need it here when the time's right, he said. Hmm. It's the right time now. I'm taking it to the right place to give it a try. Hmm. I just tried those. It's people. Our senior. Hmm. I think that's it for this. It's the right time. I think that's it for this section. I think we have to go back to where he was uh, originally, back in the cliff area. But first, while we're here, I want to uncover this. Uncover the cellar. figured out what was going on with the tallies. Uh, what we needed was... It was sternness, st sternness of stone and keenness of tiger. So we had to beat the tiger vanguard and then the um, stone vanguard. To be able to use these tallies. Now we can get a, uh, another fast travel location in here. I don't think there's any real use. I might be wrong, but I don't think there's any bosses down here. I didn't... I, I try not to spoil myself too much. some pills down here this is great what can we get celestial jade lotus pill a miraculous pill concocted by the god of like longevity in the southernmost reaches of the land that massively increases maximum health it's fantastic okay we always need those that looks like a spirit dude Am I ready for this? I don't know if I am. You know what? We're gonna... take you out first. Now we just have you. Let me use a gourd use. There we go. That's a new spirit. I'll take it. I do like that the spirits increase, uh... Increase gourd uses again, or, or refresh them. That is very useful. Did I go the right way? I thought there was a shrine around here somewhere. I'm not seeing a shrine. Let me open this chest first, but I think there's actually a shrine somewhere in this cavern that I might have passed.
I believe. Let's check this out around here. I dropped in at. Maybe, maybe it was further down. Okay, I know it's not here. Okay, must be further along then. Let's see here. Oh. Uh. Oh, there it is. I don't know what that thing is, but it looks like a boss. I think there was a pill back up on that ledge up there that I really want to go look at. Can I make my way back up here? Uh, doesn't look like you can. So what's over here? Oh, Tiger Vanguard? Is that what you're talking about? Oh, we can make more medicines. Self-refinement is the way to make golden pills. What do you got for sale here? I'll buy that. So that's the formula to make another medicine. What say you, brave one? Mortal medicines. Yeah, I'll make one of those. Or two. I still don't have any snakehead mushrooms for these, sadly. Uh... Yeah, I can't make anything with these. I have the other material. It's snakehead mushroom. Oops. Okay, I have enough for everything else. Now I'm gonna just max out these. What's celestial? Oh, okay. So, maximum health, maximum mana. Stamina, defense, stamina recovery rate, chill resistance. Oh, wait. So, we can, we can continue to make these? Is there a max? There is a max you can make. You need mine cores for each of them. I think I want to go mana... Seek from within to ascend. Seek from without to craft pills. I want to increase mana and then shock resistance, I believe. <sighs> A wondrous First off. Hovel of the universe. <laughs> I can always use more mana. Oh, that's only one. All of these are only one. Let's make these. I don't need that many. Do two of those. I just know there's a lot of shock bosses. Throughout this whole area. All things can be my material. And they do a lot of damage. 
now we can go back to health or stamina. Yeah. <laughs> That's recovery rates. Oh, it costs three for maximum health. <laughs> yep, let's make it health. From yin and yang, five elements emerge. Each nature inherits its unique creation. Each form embodies a universe. Okay, so that's all our mind cores gone. We got some nice upgrades here. I'll take it. I think that's. Wait, what? Oh, you can you can undo all your upgrades. Oh, that's sick, actually. Why does it say more stuff? Okay, let's actually get back to the quest we were actually talking about doing here. Go and rest at this shrine, and we'll head back up to the cliff where the boar was originally at. What's? Well, that's another sand slide down. I don't want to go that way. Rest first off. Get all my stuff back. And we'll travel back to... Which one is it? I think it's Win Windseal Gate? I don't think that's it. Let me check Rock Rest Flat. That might be it. Because that's where the Stone Vanguard is, I think. That should be the location. There's just so many fast travel points in this area. They've made a very large map. This is not it. Incorrect. Yeah, this is the sand waterfall area. Is it just further back this area? If I can just backtrack pretty quickly. Yeah, okay, so... I think it's over here. That's where we dropped in. This is where the shrine is. It is so confusing around here. <laughs> I get lost so easily. No, this is the sand slide. God, where the heck am I? Now I can't even find where he was at. Oh, this is a problem. Where was he at? No, I didn't want to rest. Dang it. I clicked it again. Not it. It's definitely not there. Flat's the other place, so it has to be... Windseal Gate. It has to be close to this. Let's check this out here, spirits. I don't think this is the right spot. Okay, let me... I might have to look this up here. I'm gonna mute myself for one second here. This is Fright Cliff. Where's Fright? I don't see him in either of these locations. Oh, it was Rockrest Flat, wasn't it? Okay. I'm actually looking this up right now.
I think it's over there. I just went the wrong direction. I'm gonna just bypass you guys because you're very annoying. Yep, he's back. Okay. Are you gonna come down here and fight me or can I just like lose you? I don't want to fight you if we're gonna get into a... It's definitely a boss fight right there. Oh, you're a pain in the butt. You know that? Okay, and we leveled up. I'll take it. Go ahead and use that. Sp use these sparks real quick before I regret it. I've upgraded a pluck of many, um, quite a few times. It's a very useful spell, so... Yep, I knew it. It's not a very... Got hit. Let me get back on full health here. love the freaking Skyfall strike or the Resolute strike technically. It is so freaking good. Uh, got hit by the follow-up strike. I just lost it. Dust fails, dust back up on you. Are you serious right now? You're getting on my nerves, big man. There we go. What an excellent fight. The intensity. This is good. You and I should explore that realm together.
Okay, now we can proceed in the area that was clearly a secret area. Can I get my health back first, though? Oh, we got a headgear. Snout mask. Is that any good? What does that look like? No, it doesn't. Okay, for a short duration after using the gourd, moderately increases attack. Refraining from using gourd for a relatively long duration moderately reduces attack on the contrary. So I have to use it. I mean... It doesn't mess me up too bad because I still use it quite often, but... Civet Sergeant. I still like Guang Mo. Guang Mo is the best. He saved my butt so many times at this point. We'll see what bosses we have. I still like the poison of uh, Guang Mo, or his, or his venom. It's just super, super goat tier. I know I missed the wandering white spirit. I wish I would have realized he disappears. Because I know he's a great for getting a stagger in, but Guang Mo has saved my life. Man in our time do not see the ancient moon, but this moon hath shone on men of yore. Behold! Be it the realm of sunset or the realm of gold, it's but an echo of the past. Legends speak of an ancient, colossal beetle in these sands. Whilst deep in slumber, it lay hidden beneath the Earth's embrace. When awakened, it would devour all souls that crossed its path. Its shell, harder than stone, defied the strikes of common arms. It struck fear into traveling merchants and wider to neighboring realms. But a yellow-furred rat sensed the immense power emanating from the insect. He halted the beetle's havoc and harnessed it for his own ends. Overjoyed, the king named the rat Guai, the royal sage, and built a shrine in his honor. The bound beetle was a perfect source of power, so the rat stayed. He seized the tongue monk using the new power, and battled with Soon Wukong upon the Yellow Wind Ridge. The Gwai's formidable wings failed the vast expanse of the sky. Were it not for Bodhisattva Lingji, tongue monk's quest for the scriptures would have failed. Yet, stripped of the rat's protection, the kingdom was plunged into a state of ruin. The once lush Yellow Wind Ridge now lies a desolate wasteland. Got a nice achievement out of that. What is this? Ooh, perfect. Shine right off the bat. I don't know what happened in between the cutscene and here. I don't know how we got here, but... We still got a... First shrine. <clears throat> Let's go ahead and rest here. I do need to change some medicines around. Because we did get that new one. I believe it's tiger subduing is the damage. I just want to use those. I can increase stamina and maximum health for a considerable duration. 
You traveler, back to where you belong, or meet your enemies here. I was just about to say I wasn't going to spoil the anything, but the Yellow Wind King. there's another I tag vanguard. By royal decree. A Yaogwai lurks in these sands, a scourge to the common folk. Our king seeks to subdue it. Commoners must not intrude. So there's another Tiger Vanguard, but apparently he's just a much easier version of the last Tiger Vanguard. It's pretty much the same move set though. So we're gonna see if we can beat him. At least there's a shrine right there. And I have a pluck of many this time, so it will be on my head. Any heedless You scorn my words! How have you served to the king's dinner? <laughs> That was a careless hit right there. I want to use a pluck of many. I want to see how we can handle this guy. And he's gone. Cross wash. Stand firm. Oh, you're joking right now. There we go. First try. Okay, he wasn't a tough bite. He's way easier than the OG Tiger Vanguard. But he looks like he's about to die of old age, so. Such so fierce staff work. You wield grand might. <laughs> Brave soul, why not use this might to aid my king's good deed? <clears throat> yeah, he looks like he's about to pass away from old age, so. <sighs> Our king comes from Mount Lingshan. His kind heart seeks to end the place's suffering. The Yaogwai's skills run deep. And with... The king is just ahead. With my truth being own, being a father of two little ones, my life is not mine to give. Okay, you're not the Worry father not, of... The Yellowwing King is a noble disciple from Mount Lingshan. Go and meet him. A good karma awaits you there. I was going to say, he's not the father of the Tiger Vanguard I beat and killed up top, is he? Okay, this leads to the next uh, boss fight. I do want to backtrack. I don't know if there's... Well, actually, if there's the glow here, the shrine must be near. Worry not. The yellow wing. Go and meet him. There must be a shrine nearby if there's this trail. Kingdom of Sahali. Where is this shrine at? There it is. Perfect. So that is the... I'm gonna go talk to him up top before we proceed. Go ahead and rest. Let's go talk to... I believe this is the final boss of the area. 
I mean, we're not going to fight him in this point, but I think this is actually who we're going to fight as the final boss. I believe this is the sage right here. You bested my vanguard. <laughs> then you do indeed have skills. That Yao Guai must have some vessel that counters me. Even my Samadhi wind can't hurt it. <sighs> there is only one way to draw out this Yao Guai. I'll sound the drums and it'll come forth. If you are willing, I ask you to seize its vessel at the right time. Then the Yao Guai will be mine. We're gonna draw this beast. We're gonna fight him. Okay, yep. That's a giant beetle. Food bond. Doesn't look that big from up here, but here at the western end of the world, each day the sun sets and boils the sea. The boiling hiss is sharp enough to ravage babies in their cradles. The people sound drums to counter the impact. But the drums draw this Yao Guai. The vessel this Yao Guai holds protects it from me. Your boldness in venturing here is... Okay. It's right here, beneath us in the sand. I'm kind of skipping through this a little it's bit. It's right here. Okay, he's not saying anything else. Is there anything back here I can pick up before I venture into the boss fights? I really don't know how tough this dude is. I, all I really wanted to do off camera was figure out where the bosses are. I didn't do a bunch of uh, research onto who they are because I wanted to go into it blind with potentially you guys if you are new to this series like I am. Nothing over here. Oh, there's a chest. I'll take that. Free chest. That leads down into the boss area as well. Is there anything back where I came on the opposite side, like near the building? Yeah, I want to discover that first. We'll go along the ridge, and then we'll head down to the boss fight. The shrine's right here. What's up in here in the building? It's an open chest right there. You got for me not a voidness and a gold ridge beast what else is this is a freaking big place for just this boss fight there has to be a bunch more around here another chest oh I thought I oh that's empty dang it meditation spot this is what i'm talking about i believe this is the last thing in this area we go head on to the boss now and put that last spark in before the boss fight Yeah, this is this stuff like this is the exact reason why some of these playthroughs for me take a little bit longer than normal. This is because I'm an exploration guy. I like seeing the whole map. Especially, I say that I'm not gonna do it if it's like a super ungodly massive map, like there is in some games. But if it's a moderate size like this one, it's not unconsciously big. Like it's not ridiculous. It's large, but 
he can still handle it. Okay, let's stamina build back up. Well, we already saw his... Oh, he's gonna... Oh, okay. Where the heck am I? Oh, that hit hard. beneath them. his front claws that are a weak point. Back underground? Yeah, I figured. Okay, this is not a super tough boss. Unless he changes up his moves somewhere soon. Oh, yeah. Oh, so he, he does that as well. Oh, my lord. And I'm dead. Okay. I was just saying it wasn't that tough of a boss. I didn't realize he does this move, though. Well, now I know. I can perfect dodge out of those, though. In the west lies the kingdom of Sahili, the end of the sky. Every day in the hour of sunset, the king would order the drums beaten and the horns sounded. Okay, let's head back down here. Now I know what to expect, at least. So he gets some second hits in on on the uh, jump up in the sand here. The he got a secondary hit in after I jumped out of the way. Yeah, he, he, I can't avoid that main hit. I did not know that was an attack he does. Gotta use a gourd here. I 
stay relatively close to him. Ah, got hit by it. Stepped on me, are you serious? Okay. Now this is what I gotta be careful of. Is he going to come up again? Oh god. I tried to dodge that too and it just didn't work. I gotta keep using my freaking flask. What? Oh, it, it makes him mad. I don't think I want to make him mad. Oh, this is what prevents him from helping. Oh, and I'm on top of him. Great. I'll join you. this oh I gotta be near him crap I missed all that damage opportunity Fubon defeated. Oh, that was sick. Okay. Telling me I have to fight that guy as the final boss of this chapter? Is that what you're telling me right now? 
I don't think I want to. Fu Bond wasn't that tough. I died because I was careless and I didn't know his moveset yet, but I gotta fight On that the dude. Folks behalf, I thank you. Can I just say no? Can I just like I refuse? He seems to be a good guy. I don't want to fight him. I'm gonna die a lot. I think we're getting close to the equipment point for this part. Fought a couple bosses in there. Who would we have? We had the Tiger Vanguard, Fubon, who else? Oh, and the, uh... The Apprentice here, the boar, drunken boar, dude. What do we get? Wind Tamer, abide by the Buddha's decree, here to subdue the Yellow Wind Gwai. And Sky Piercing Horn. So that's another vessel. We had the fireproof. I don't need that at the moment. Okay, massively increases damage reduction for a short duration and grants immunity to strong winds. I think that's exactly what we need. I think I think that's the main reason you go for this. Uh... You go for this secret boss is because the Yellow Wind Sage, the final boss, the dude we just helped, um, uses wind wind attacks. I could lose the defense, but get the accessible hits with the light attack combo. Moderately increases the attack. I still want the de defense, I think. I don't know what uh, spirit is good for the final boss here. I don't know if I need to switch to Gorai, Taoist, or something. I might do a little research what he's weak to. Um, let's see what else we have. Sky Piercing Horn. That should be... We should be able to use... Finally upgrade our... Bow Staff, maybe? Our drunken boar guy is gone, so we need to make our way back to the shrine. Yep, this dude's always here. we go and I, I didn't even put the spark in did I for that final boss I didn't even put in the spark I'm a dummy where's the shrine at oh, I freaking hate these guys actually before we depart I think there's actually supposed to be another boss around here I believe he's called like man in stone or something He's not technically a boss, but... He's supposed to be somewhere in this area. I believe. So before we call it quits for this part, I want to explore, try to find that dude. He's in the area with the uh, Mother of Stones from the last part. Oh, is there another Buddha's thing around here? If I get all six, I can come back and fight the, uh... Oh, it's back here. Oh! Jesus Christ, dude. Stop freaking jump-scaring me like that. I think my third Buddha's eye. This is another secret boss where, uh... Another secret boss, if you get all six of these, where the stone vanguard is, you can summon a different boss. Where is this guy at? I already know what you are. He should be around here. Where the heck is he?
There's a chest. I'll take that. Yao Guai Core. I want to figure this out. Man in Stone, I believe is his name. There's another chest right there. Get this chest. I'll take it. More stuff to sell. Where is this guy at? I want to find him. Did I go into the wrong tunnel? Is he actually right next to uh, Mother of Stones? Because I think that's the upwards tunnel. And we went the downwards tunnel. I think that might be it. He's supposed to look pretty obvious. Oh, don't want to go that way. Wait, is this, uh... Yep. Nope, that's not the right thing. Maybe it was up this way. Or does this lead to the same thing? No, we're gonna fight this dude. Ooh, that does a lot of damage. Is this guy at? It is so freaking dark in here, man. This is back to where we were. Let's backtrack. Go all the way back to the beginning area here. After I pick up. The right way. There's the shrine. Oh, what the? Must his head be on the Ah, more of these guys. What the? You know, I'm gonna mute myself for one second and try to find this guy. I will be right back, ladies and gentlemen. Or actually, am I close? Oh, there's another Buddha's. Can't move. Okay, I want to get out of range of these guys. There's another one up there. How do I get up there? Oh. I heard somebody. There he is. This is the Some dude right here. Has got him trapped in this rock with his spell. And the rocks and the ridge have come to life. In that cave, should you uncover the ridge, I can fight that way out. Okay, what he wants is you, uh... Rocks turning into guise. 
just is no small matter. Are you serious? Okay. Let me hug the wall here. So what he apparently wanted was to fight Mother... Wanted you to fight Mother of Stones to be able to free him. Get lost! I'm just gonna have my boys team up on you right quick. So he wants you to beat Mother of Stones to free him. I don't know what he if he gives you anything or not. I hate these guys with the freaking spit things. What was that? Oh, Zur Dust. Transform into a rock guy, immune to all four bands. Yeah, you expecting another treasure? You wicked. But I can't be. Come back later. So we can come back later to trade. Easy there. Okay. That's a new transformation, at least. put these in. Okay, so there's a dude up there with Buddha eyes. So we're gonna have to go get that. Find our way up here. we go. So I think this is number four. I might try to go ahead and find him. And before we start the uh, big boss in the next part, we'll fight the other secret boss. I think there's only two left besides the main boss. There's the dude you get from the Buddha eyes. And then uh, the, I, I believe it's red or black long. I, for I forget which one. Um, I think that's a Buddha statue way over there. So, I think those are the only two secret bosses left, and then it's just the main boss. That looked like a Buddha statue over there. We're going to find out. I knew it. Yep. We gotta just keep wandering around looking for the sound. It's a very singular sound. <laughs> mm. 
I have no clue where I'm at right now. It looks new, though. There's something up here. Oh, you followed me all the way over here, of course. Oh, this is the bridge back to the second prince boss fights. No way! Are you joking right now? So I think it's in the Fright Cliff area is where the statues are, so or the Buddha statues. I don't think this is anywhere near where the where the next one is. We're just going to rock and roll right by you. There's a shrine right there. Did I miss that? Are you serious right now? I did. I did, in fact, miss this one. We're going to go ahead and rest so these guys disappear on me. Okay. Now we can craft. Is it armor? Oh, insect hat. Upon taking medicine, grants considerable focus. Increases the duration of all medicine. Oh, God. Medicinal effects. I don't think I even really want any of these. They're better. They're better. But I think I'm going to need Cloud Step for the uh, Wind Goai boss. So I don't want to lose any of the stuff I currently have equipped. Is there any upgrades I can get? Doesn't look like it. Okay, we need to find one more Buddha statue. Backtrack this way. See if this leads to it. Okay, we've been here. Do I hear any more? In this area. Must mercy hands so woe upon thee. For what thee must from streams into sands thou flee? Did I miss one over here? I don't. I don't hear one. I gotta find this last Buddha statue. I don't wanna finish this out in this part. I hear that singing dude again. back on this side. I 
think we have five of them. Where is that last one at? We have all six, dummy. Oh my lord, I'm searching for something we already have. Okay, let's backtrack here and we're gonna call it quits for this part. <laughs> I didn't even check, think to check and make sure. So, I believe with all six Buddha's eyeballs, we can uh, summon another boss. I don't know where at. I know he's in this area though. What is this? Deliver. I think that's one of the eyeballs. Okay, I know it summons another boss. We're going to do that in the next part, though. Getting a little late here for me to be filming still. So, is that it? Okay. I hope you guys enjoyed this part. Make sure to like, subscribe, leave me a feedback down below. And I will see you guys in the next part with, uh, I think it's another stone vanguard, technically. Technically, just like we had two tiger. And then we'll go do the final boss of this of this chapter. <laughs> the only things we're missing in chapter one and two are the secret boss of uh, Red and Black Long. So, like I said, I hope you guys enjoyed. Make sure to like, subscribe, leave any feedback down below. And I will see you guys next time. Take care.